wonder you couldn't hear me. Is that your new tape? Star-Lord? Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the space riders. And he's not scary. He's cool. Your space rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out! Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma! What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom does. Maybe we should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm hmm Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. Your father and I would just lie on the hood of my old Chevy and listen to Black Sabbath and... You like Black Sabbath? Like I said, your mom's cooler than you think. Oh, he'd look up at the stars and he'd... Tell me all about the places he'd been. Mom? How about some cake, huh? Yeah, I'll be up in a sec. You said that 15 minutes ago. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. <laughs> you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Hey, watch the hair. <laughs> We've talked about you leaving your toys on the floor. It's not a toy. It's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. He doesn't even... Never mind. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. Stop doing this, man. It's weird. We are approaching the quarantine zone. How long was I out for? 15,338 ticks. That's very specific. The betrayer is ready to begin our mission. She has requested your presence in the cockpit. Gamora's on our side, Drax. She is the spawn of my sworn enemy, a murderess and a traitor. I do not trust her.
Okay, here we go. Rocket crew tracks, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Nova Corps security guard resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we will get stranded. If we wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Nova net still up? Thought we were going in. Well, it appears the assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor codes are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. Zero, four, five, one. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacore. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption key of some sort, designed to integrate temporal coordinates in our ship's heart. There. Restraint wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacore had 12 years to get rid of the heavy-duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Rodent. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overhaul. Plus, there's good money in it. The piece that we seek is far more valuable to the Monster Queen of Seknoff 9 than any illegally acquired salvage. Whoa! Oh, place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster, but that big cylinder up ahead looks like the mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. <clears throat> friend? For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Group Quell Soda. Team Rockets up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the Assassin. Oh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green. It's teal. Teal? What? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks to the drop site. Ground's too unstable to land the ship, so you'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, group. Hey, don't worry! Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle, and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. Done. Meet you at the rendezvous point. Mora, take care of my baby. It's a ship, Peter, not a child. Huh. Oh, can you imagine? What, the pink coop? It's custom nano resin, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. Coordination of the assassin has become insufferable. Uh, okay, guess you're taking. Oh, huh. you okay, Quill? Yeah, I think so. This uh, pink resin stuff's definitely strong enough to hold this place together. Oh yeah, 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 definitely, probably strong enough. Yep, being here definitely feels a little weird. Yo, Quill, these coordinates are so reliable. How come we're the only ones out here trying to catch this thing? We're the only ones crazy enough! Oh. 
You find something we could sell? Nah, just some old correspondence. You know how I like to brush up on galactic war history. Um, no? Don't think I've ever seen you read anything without pictures. I read plenty of non-picture stuff. I'm thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by... Pink goo. Ebrium based nano resin. Whatever. I'm just saying, it's a lot to take in. Oh, look! Yellow and blue. Looks like an old Novacore frigate. Nice! Come on, dude. People probably died on that ship. Killjoy, why'd he even bring us here if the place is so sacred? <laughs> I can name at least a dozen planets with monsters on them, so why here? You think it's to impress Gamora? Like, don't know if you noticed, know Rocket, but people aren't exactly falling over themselves to hire us. Oh, I have noticed. If this job pans out, sure we'll get money, but also a rich new client. You need to impress Lady Hellbender with a monster she's interested in, not just any old critter. You know, I like this. This is fun. <laughs> the three of us, hanging out. Just like when we started this gig, before you-know-who joined us. I am Quilt. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Quill's a, a swell guy. I hope you get that promotion, Rocket. Come on, Rocket. Drax and Gamora are valued additions to the team. You're only saying that because she's listening. Is that why your plan has Drax and I taking the ship? Maybe. Hey, can't a guy want to spend some quality time with his friends? After we sell the monster, I say we head to nowhere. Pretty sure that way's a dead end. Eh, uh, you sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on. How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Hey, group, you think we could find pieces of the Trion shard in here? How'd you even know the other way was a dead end? Because, unlike you, I have a very keen sense of direction. <sighs> I don't know what it looks like. Oh, uh, Watch it, Quill! Uh, Woo! <laughs> All good, no worries. But watch your step, guys. This junk isn't as stable as we think. Take that, brittle stuff! <laughs> Gross. <laughs> nice splatter. Hey! Fifty units says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if. Whoa, what the? Rocket, did you do that? The scoreboard? You like it? Hacked it into your visor cover last time you took a snooze. You hacked into my stuff? Considering how many times I fixed the flarkin thing, it might as well be my stuff. Optimal thumper placing distance should be just up ahead. I'm thinking right in front, through the giant... I should have been recording. Bridge over. I want to see if he's alive. I don't know, but he's twitching. Flarkin, Scott Stain, Quill. You okay down there? Yep. Yeah, just, uh... Thought I saw a shortcut. shortcut. Right. Go ahead without me. I'll catch up. Okay. There's a crapped out Novacore missile bay just on the other side. We'll meet you there. Yellow and blue missile bay. Got it. Okay. Crawling through creepy old ship. No big deal. Easy there, Quill. Pretty sure nothing's gonna jump out at you. Except maybe me and Groot. All right, Team Rocket. We just set up another couple of thumpers. Floor! Trying to bring the whole place down, Quill? I shot a thing. I get it. First tool in the... Ooh, don't die, don't die, don't die! Aw, 
hey little guy. Whoa, what the fuck? You dead, Quill? We can hear your wussy squeal even without the car. Little busy! Crap! That's cheating! You guys should have seen that. It was this weird blobby thing. <laughs> Not falling for this again. One last freaky eye thing! Okay over there? Quill nearly got himself eaten by a blob or something. Should have heard him squeal. You must fight with dignity, Peter Quill. Or at least die with it. Not funny. How's Team Rocket doing down there? We're fine. Waiting for Quill to show up. Uh, Quill, we got a lot riding on your gal pal's mystery monster tip. I hope she's legit. Like, you could even tell if she had an honest face. Yeah, she did smell like flowers. If we set up all these thumpers and no monster shows, we'll just need to salvage what scrap we can and haul it back with us. Yeah, scrubbing off all that nano resin would take forever. If it even comes off. Just trust me on this. It'll mother of Scott! No! Are you kidding me? Son of a smack! That was too close! You okay, Groot? Well, we're fine, but we can't jump that. You don't gotta jump. There's a sturdy support beam on this side. Get Groot to grow a bridge across. Just ask him nice like. He does it for me all the time. All right, Groot. Let's see that cool vine. That's one hell of a party trick, big guy. Gross. More ship eaters. Oh, they're everywhere. All right, back to business. Boom! Right under your nose, Quill. Double agent is trying to lull me into a false sense of security. Hey, Greenies, you see any blue and gold ships out there? You let us know. We have seen many such ships. He means active ones. We haven't talked about what to do if we run into a Nova Corps patrol. Uh, we will restrain them until we are done here. Bad idea. Those cops are all connected through their stupid helmets. If, if you see cops, you get my ship out of here, even if it means leaving us behind. Uh, flark that! Trust me, I've dealt with Nova Corps before. Even helped them catch real criminals. I can talk my way out. You think the Milano can? Okay, here we go. All right, set her down right there. Yep, one to go. Flark! No, no! Flark and Skaggy! Attack and batteries fly, that's what's wrong. Maybe you put it down too hard. Let's just find a solution. The solution's a new battery, with a charge. Okay. We're on what's left of a ship. Full of ship things. Gotta be things that power ship things around here, right? Yeah. Maybe you're gonna want to use your visor for this. You find a replacement while I get it scraping the fried wires. How do we know the monster we're looking for ain't one of these things we already killed? If it were worthy of Lady Hellbender's collection, it would not die so easily. Hope we know this thing when we see it and not after we stopped it. Found something with a charge! Kinda looks like a spacey car battery. Lucoid or Xenon cell. Okay! 
This thing isn't gonna zap me, right? The chance is... minuscule. At best. You'll be fine. Here you go. That'll do nicely. Just let me tinker a bit. I'll have to do some tweaking once I see how much juice this thing puts out. So, uh, watch my back. Watch it from what? Rocket! Help me scramble some critters! No, 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 Scott! If I don't rewire this fast, it's gonna short circuit! to see you fix it next time. Come on, two down, two to go. Groot's wondering if the reward's gonna be worth all the risk we're taking for this job. Me and Groot are nearly unkillable, but what if the rest of you don't make it out alive? If the two of us gotta lug that monster- Guys, this job is a huge deal. It's for the freaking monster queen of Seknarf 9. She just doesn't know it yet. We pull this off, and we're- Lady Hellbender's intergalactic monster anglers? Man, that thing is ridiculous. I think it was a ship or a robot. That's a pre-century. A robot, but it would have been space worth. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. They designed at least five experimental models twice that size. Plus half a dozen mega-century prototypes. How do you know all this? Because they were my fellow experiments back on Half-World. Most of my parts came from the cybernetics hangar next to the door, so, uh... I got a sneak peek at all the new killbots. I can see the parts come and go from my, uh... Uh, my cage. I didn't mean to open old wounds. Eh, most of them are just scars now anyways. Groot, I need you to shoot a bridge right into that eye socket. <laughs> Now, I want to see you do that to something in combat. Wait, what's that? Yes! I'm about to win this bet, Quill! <laughs> We're inside a giant robot head. And I got robot parts inside my head. You have robot parts inside your head. Rocket scores! <sighs> hey, Groot. What do you think I should do when I win this bet? I mean with the units he'll owe me once I win. <laughs> well, I know what I'll be doing with my winnings. I'm saving up for our next stop on Contraxia to get one of those Zeronian massages. Uh, you're so predictable. Are. 
Exactly. You suck, Starshot. What do you think, Drax? Should we get in on this bet? Think of all the hyper circuits you can buy. Are you making fun of me? I do not wish to acquire hyper circuits. team is officially ineligible for the bet. Why? Well, for one, you need a gun. There's no need for a projectile weapon. <laughs> Splat! Were I allowed to participate? Uh, you know what, Quill? I think it's unfair. You got two guns, I got one. I think my points should count double from now on. That's cheating. All right, Thump. It's not gonna piss off every critter around, right? Sorry, Quill. Not taking no chances after the last one. I gotta test it real quick. Not again. Rocket, I only flipped the switch on and off to see if it started. Yeah, tell them that. Gotta love that kill rate. Points like that. Looks like we're done installing our thumpers. Great job. We'll meet you at the mining ship. All right, mining rig is right there. Of course it's secure. As secure as a broke down Shatari shipwreck's ever gonna be. It's totally safe. See? I'll even prove it. Huh? Look at this. Rocket? Oh, fuck. Guys, jump! No, no, no! Son of 
a job. Come on, Quill. He says I'll meet us at the mining ship. I don't want to make him wait. That's it? We're not going after him? He says it's fine. We'll meet him later. Team Rocket, is everything okay? Groot's signal just went dark. Flock. His radio must have broke when he fell. Uh, Groot just took a different path and must have fell and broke his radio. Uh, yeah, that's it. Why take a different path? Team Rocket, over! <laughs> Hope that got rid of him. Uh, sounds like Green Team's off our backs. Now we can stop worrying about that uh, dumb accident. Groot's fine anyways. There's nothing to worry about. Not like I could have prevented that old rusted ship from keeling over. An accident rocket? Come on! What? That's all it was. It's your fault! If you hadn't fooled around on that ship... I did it! You don't know nothing. Stop trying to be smart. That sure didn't sound like an apology. Mining ship's on the other side of that turbine, so we gotta find a way through. Try not to jump on anything this time. Groot's not there to grab you if you... Well, either shut up or help me figure out how these blades open. I can hear your visor working. Better not be cheating on our bet, Quill. How can you hear that? There's a drone access tunnel over here. Too bad we don't got a drone. Can you squeeze in there? Knew it. Rocket, fix the thing. Rocket, clean up the mess. Rocket, crawl into the mystery hole. See anything? Yeah, a manual override. Team Rocket, we hit a snag. One of our thumper points was covered in resin, so we're gonna fly around and scout another spot. Just make sure the new spot as close as possible to the original one. Because of uh, maps and angles. Great, another turbine. Yeah, that is how these things are usually built. Hey, Gamora, did you really chop up the Shatari queen? Pew, pew. Imagine towing all this shut by hand. Come on, let's get out of here. Hey, hey, what gets louder as it gets smaller? I don't know. A Shatari in a trash compactor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. We're back on track. The mining ship ain't too far. I think Groot's already ahead. Cap, 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 cap! It wasn't me this time, I swear! I don't like this! Hope I don't tear my pants! I'm gripping this thing with muscles I didn't even know I had! I told you I saw them. Great timing! How did you guys... Good to see you two, but you're gonna want to cross the ship as fast as you can. We're seeing a lot of movement. Yeah, Scott's getting real violent out here. Uh, just try to hold her still for us! That's not gonna be an option soon! This position is untenable. Drax says incoming! Watch out! What? Hang on! You perished, Peter Quill. No, 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 no. Too much debris! I'm taking her out of here! Go! Keep running! Stop walking around, man! Really? Well, this way! Team Rocket! Did you make it inside? Yeah, all in one piece. <sighs> Got it. Meet you in a tick. No rush. It's uh, nice and cozy in here. Not so much when you can't see in the dark. Ah, I think I felt the panel. Yeah, there's wiring in there. See if I can get the systems back on. How long is this gonna take? Oh, come on. Clark and tensor joint. Just neat. Uh, wiggle the. Okay, so life support's going back up. What's it look like out there? Holy mother of space particles.
Well, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, it's just... Man. of old cleaner bots. Maybe. Old cleaner bots? I don't know. Were that freaky thing we accidentally released. Saw! We saw some cleaner bots <laughs> accidentally at a distance. <coughs> We're totally all right. They just ran away when it saw us, right, Quill? <coughs> and I'm glad you're safe, too. Rocket, I'm not so sure that swarm thing was inoffensive. I feel kind of bad about releasing it. <coughs> Quill took a pot shot at this massive worm. Look at this old beauty. I am Groot. A table. This is a vintage Model T engineering workbench. They don't make them sturdy like that no more. Hey, come on, Quill. Let's see if this beauty still works. Maybe I can fix up your gear. Hey, hand me that part. One tick. Done. And it's done. Yeah, there's a way through if we can clear. Come on, Quill, put them pea shooters to good use so we can squeeze in there. Oh, yeah! Nailed it! <clears throat> and, uh, thanks for the upgrade. has been messing up our comms. Yeah, something really ain't right in here. And Quill fell down another hole. Another one. I'm parking in Milano, but Drax is out there searching for you. Maybe you'll find Quill before we do. We're trying to catch up to him. Guys, we really need to get better at the buddy system. She is not my buddy. I will find you, Peter Quill. Describe your surroundings. Uh, old metal, old mining equipment, just old. Noted. Hello? <laughs> Another freaky thing! How freaky? Kill it! I read my mind! This thing refuses to 
says I tripped on something. Murder Mom probably closed the door behind her. Excuse me? What do we do if this monster turns out to be sapient? We would likely receive higher compensation. Hey, we ain't caged in nothing that can complain about You it. and Groot are ex-bounty hunters. I am Groot. I am Groot. Fine. Me and Groot were messing with some subsystems. I may have tripped something. I said I may have. Look, if it's got power to close, it's got power to open. It looks like it's still got some juice. Give it a go, Rocket. What a genius at work. You are a miracle worker, man. This tech was built by people who make holes in giant floating space rocks. I have to say, that is an am- Yeah, yeah. This is it. Last spot. Can't wait to be out of here. This place feels like it's about to collapse on itself. I cannot wait to meet our monster. I thought you were mostly interested in meeting the buyer. She is a respectable collector. Is it working? Yeah, yeah. Don't worry, sunshine. <laughs> Is it, uh, doing it? What? It appears to be broken. Ain't nothing broke. That's the sound it's supposed to make. What sound? You can't hear that. Hear what? Our monster. Hey, that thing is bad! Don't let it get behind you! It could be poisonous! Lady Hellbender will pay extra if it is poisonous! Does it look friendly? It looks like a monster in my to hide behind. Good thinking, Will. Smoke the rock! Maybe try calling it like a pet! Here, monster! Who's a good monster? Bad creature! Come face your punishment! Are 
Are we even sure this is the right creature? Not like any of the other uglies here. This one's something special. It's okay, buddy. Groot don't like things that move fast. Somebody kneecaps! Do even have kneecaps? Somebody just grab it! Vile thing! Stop moving! Been too long since I blew something up! I'm ready! Just find me an opening! Come on! Put him down! It's got nowhere left to hide. But it can still run! There's gotta be some way to slow it down! Branch out, group! <laughs> what the flark is that? Definitely not a monster. Adorable. It's more matted than an Asgardian goat. We cannot present this pathetic creature to the monster queen of Sektoff 9. She will laugh at us. Maybe we can use it as bait. I knew those thumpers wouldn't work. What? My thumpers are state-of-the-art. Musclehead's the one who rushed at the first thing that came through the door. My head is not made of muscle. What the... Oh! Uh, you guys seeing what I'm seeing? That is a monster. All right. Enough with the warm up. Time to catch us a real monster. Let's get paid. What in hell's name is that? Definitely not cleaner bots. Place is crapping out. We gotta get out of here now. Curse these volatile ruins. Tracks go. Hold on to your butts, people. Rocket, hit the music. On it. Focus on flying, Peter. So
means you screwed up because you had to fly away from it. Uh, please don't be Novacore. Please don't be Novacore. Please don't be Novacore. It is Novacore.